I'm going to show you how to create this cool flash effect. To get started, I just added two clips to my timeline that I'd like to add my flash effect between. Let's begin by right-clicking inside the project panel and going to a new item adjustment layer. Then right-click your adjustment layer in the project panel and go to speed slash duration. I'm going to delete the default 5 seconds and change the last two zeros to 15 so that my adjustment layer lasts for 15 frames. If you want faster or slower flash, you can make it last for a few frames more or less. Then direct your adjustment layer under the track above your clips and center it above the cut. If you're having a hard time centering it above the cut, position your time marker at the cut and use this bar down here to zoom into the timeline. Select your adjustment layer, and then while holding down the Alt key on your keyboard, press the right or left arrow keys to nudge the clip so that it's centered over the cut. If you're using a Mac, hold down the Option key while using the arrow keys. Once your adjustment layer is centered over the cut, go over to the Effects Panel Type Brightness into the search box. Drag the Brightness and Contrast effect onto your adjustment layer. Make sure your adjustment layer is selected and go over to Effect Controls Position the Time Marker at the start of your adjustment layer clip. Click the stopwatch next to both Brightness and Contrast to create starting key frames. Move the time marker to the middle of the adjustment layer. Increase the brightness and contrast to 100 to create two more key frames in the middle of your adjustment layer. Then position your time marker at the end of your adjustment layer clip. Change the brightness and contrast back to zero to create ending key frames. Okay, and now when I play this back of a nice looking flash effect in Premiere Pro. Thanks for watching and see you next time.